so I'm Yeah. Well, the first poet we're going to have on is um, Tom Jenks. He's going to read, and uh, he's going to be introduced in the second half, so that'd be kind of a, a backwards reading, uh, kind of delayed, delayed introduction. Um, next open reading in London's on the 14th of May, but this is the main event at the moment. That's what I'm going to say before anything, really. Yeah, let's get going. Let's get going. Tom Jenks. Twenty biographical fragments. Fragment two six three nine six. His unrivalled knowledge of bus routes made him indispensable. E.g., the secret terminus behind the surgery visible only at times of eclipse. Fragment 30854. An angel in the garden. His mother, perhaps, but she was not dead yet, upstairs by the heater doing cryptic crosswords. Fragment 26248. His mother, for whom a man laid down his raincoat, gabardine with vented lapels, fashionable back then for a week or two. Fragment 28126, the scuffs on his left shoe, sacred in a galaxy far, far away, each one drawn precisely to scale and represented in holy texts. Fragment 38333, patter of hailstones on the hood of his parker, loud enough to wake the woman who was almost once nearly his wife. Fragment 37177, the risks he took with signifiers. Ten years staked on the way that girl stirred the ice in her whiskey and water. Fragment 36373. Much later, he realised he had mistaken youth for beauty, alone in a bungalow with his leather-bound sonnets. Fragment 33086. That time in the greenhouse lived with him forever. Smell of ripe tomatoes on a winter afternoon taste of horseradish on his lips. Fragment 29641. His preference for a deodorant discontinued in 1978. 600 canisters stacked in the cellar amongst the tins of luncheon meat. <coughs> Fragment 37764. In his 30s, a period of unreality. The ghost came while he ate crispy pancakes, tapping him on the shoulder gently. Fragment 39517. He dreamt an eagle bore him to the House of Fame, over the statue of a noted alderman, his bell bottoms brushing the lightning conductor. Fragment 35682. His capsule wardrobe, black shoes, black shirt, black trousers, black tie, black polo neck, black hat, black cane, green carnation. <laughs> Fragment 31600. He built a model of the Lusitania with melted down spoons stolen slowly from cafes. Fragment 34557. His irrational fear of certain vibrations, latent until her moistened finger teased the top C from the salad bowl. <laughs> Fragment 37662. Lacking the strength of character to grow long hair, he wore a wig to the Byron Convention. Fragment 35431, Pickles, his dappled wolfhound blessed with the gift of tongues. He appeared several times on local radio until the public tired of him. <laughs> Fragment 29178, Hard Times During the Great Marmalade Shortage. Fragment 37793, There is no recorded instance extant in the archives of him ever eating peppered mackerel. Fragment 6890, his grandfather's pocket watch once stopped a bullet, but still told the right time twice a day. Fragment 40442. Once on television they mentioned his name, anagrammatically, during the weather. This is... Um, a translated piece, this is from a medieval manuscript, you might be familiar, it's called Brief Wives of the Saints. Um, Saint Ambrose, he done some good things, 
But when a bee sting me, he just laughed, and he should not have done this. Saint Augustine, he done some good things, but he cheats at hungry hippos because he knocked my arm on purpose. <laughs> Saint Basil, the fool for Christ, he done some good things, but he always got no clothes on, and in Asda he got arrested near Bananas. Saint Cuthbert, he done some good things, but I asked him for a sip of his mead. And he said, by your own, you tight bastard. St. Francis, he done some good things, but his budgie did great big shits on my shoe and he never whippy it off. St. Thomas the Apostle, he done some good things, but I asked if he want brew and he take two hours to say no tar. St. Keith, he never done good things, he not really saints, he just wear a dressing gown and puff slippers at bus stop. St. <laughs> Peter, he done some good things, but he had me upside down in Morrison's calf and my face go red like beetroot. Saint Jerome, he done some good things, but he made me touch the skull and it really horrible, rubbery leathery. Saint Simon the Zealots, he done some good things, but he don't half bang on, and he get his mad eyes like a snake or something. Saint Polinus of York, he done some good things, but he hit me with a stone and now it hurt there when it rains. Saint Aidan, he done some good things, but when I lit fag in Boozebuster, he took it off me and said, didn't I know the law? St. Christopher, he done some good things, but I asked him to carry me and he said, no, you are too fat. St. <laughs> George, he done some good things, but Bobby seen him with top off and he got mild and bitter writ over his nips. St. Acker, he done some good things, but he played bloody sexy phone all the time and it gave me headache. St. Nicholas, he done some good things, but he asked what I want for Christmas. I say Tommy Hilfinger and he'd get me Mars bar. St. <laughs> Mark the Evangelist, he'd done some good things but he full of it because he went Venice and got off the foreign bird in Gondola. St. <laughs> Gary, he never done good things, but he not saints, he'd get money for lifeboats if preaching could spend it on crisps, bad sod. St. Michael, he done some good things, but he wear these wife fronts and he make me eat broccoli quiche for breakfast. St. <laughs> Julian of Norwich, he done some good things, but he really woman with man name, like John Wayne or Big Danny, but other way, freak. <laughs> okay, um, I'm going to read from it, there's a short sequence of poems called Protocols, uh, protocol being in the sense of um, rules of communication, particularly I'm thinking of here sort of uh, computing rules of communication, as in hybrid text transfer, text transfer protocol, HTTP. Um, this is what happens if you sit and look at a computer all day, so it does your imagination. So you try and turn it on. Okay, I'm going to read the first one. Um, protocols 1. Personal has no place other than emphasis, e.g. font. Experiences may be salient. Death, insert here. Thinking deeply does not mean breathing deeply. Less than or equal to four breaths per calendar month. Footnotes. Some telescoping permissible, soup course, consult, rain jars, aphid traps, gap charts. Experiments with taste and texture. One, touch an apple. Two, taste an apple. High speed internet connection obviates need for face to face transaction. Download here, here, and here. Moon, no moon, decide what happened and tell an adult. Footnotes, these things just distractions. Talking cows invented by Bismarck, Czech ref. She said we had to talk things over, say here whether you have done it. Shopping list, yogurts, 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 yogurts. Footnotes, move to spam folder, delete, barrister Kalu Odumu, make me millionaire, tear here. We're not going to tear it. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to read a bit of public service uh, broadcasting for the uh, last one of this 10 minutes that I'm going to do. Um, this is 99 Names for Small Dogs, so this is a service for anyone who'd like to think of a name for a dog. Um, okay, Admiral Nelson, Albert, Arbuthnot, Archduke Franz Ferdinand, Arthur, Bartleby, Bingo, Bismarck, Bisto, Bobby, Branston, Brian, 
Canutes, Captain Ahab, Captain Moonlight, Captain Pugwash, Carlos Bellardo, Charlemagne, Chatsworth, Chief Bighorn, Chivers, Chuck, Colonel Mustard, Colonel Sanders, Columbo, Constable Fletcher, Dr. Billabong, Duke Humphrey, Duppy Conqueror, Emperor Napoleon, Ethelred, Felipe, Flash Gordon, Fletcher Christian, Gandalf, Ganesh, Gebhard von Blücher, Giant Haystacks, Gustavus Adolphus, Helmut, Herr Schmidt, His Holiness Pope Pius, Hotspur, Inspector Morse, Jehovah, Jeremy, Johnson, Keith, King Zog, Lancelot, Lieutenant Pigeon, Little Richard, Lord George Gordon, Lord Piccadilly, Mark Antony, Marmaduke, Master Chalk, Metternich, Monsignor Alvaro, Mr. Pringle, Mr. Rutherford, Mr. Sausage, Nigel, Norbert Desentrigil, Nuno Gomez, Otto, Oxo, Paxman, Percy, Peter Sissons, Pitt the Elder, Pitt the Younger, Prince Eugene, Prince Rogers Nelson, Pushkin, Quincy, Reginald Perrin, Royston, Scipio Africanus, Serge, Shirley Crabtree, Socrates, Steve, Stormy Norman, <laughs> Sven, Swain Forkbeard, Tarquin, Thaddeus, Ulysses de la Cruz, Burson Getterix, Viscount Stepney, Vishnu, Wilberforce, William of Orange, Xavier, Yogi, Zachariah, Zico. Thank you. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.